so I just got my Halloween subscription box in the mail. Um, Seance Perfumes, which I'm obsessed with. And, uh, oh, now I forgot the other company. I think it's Girl in the Graveyard. Um, collaborated and came up with a subscription box called Seance in the Graveyard. Um, so I'm kind of puzzled if it's like an actual subscription box and I'm going to get like more throughout the year or if it's just like a Halloween box because it seemed like it was just one thing but it's called subscription box so I don't know but uh, Halloween um, it gives you info on everything that's in there uh, when you open it up it has this cool kind of beetle you see striped packaging striped tissue paper it's an orange box which is cool Halloween uh, she's got her classic black bubble wrap going on um, so we have this something wicked pumpkin spice maple vanilla cake foaming sugar scrub in there I briefly opened it earlier because I couldn't wait um, you open it up and I think that's just a soap the little ghost guy thing maybe it isn't but they also included, or she included, some like sample soaps. Let's see if I can find them. This like black little bag. We got a little bat. And it's Basic Witch. Um, it doesn't tell me what the scent is on that one. I got this little, whoops, I got a little thread stuck on there. Skull dude, and that's strange and unusual, and another bat shaped Cthulhu. So, those are fun little extras. Um, and then she, uh, the graveyard, I one girl in the graveyard is the one that does the soap, so there's a Dark Shadows Hand and Body Soap. It smells like red musk, cherries, sandalwood, and roses. Got this cute little skull. Black and red. Very cute. Uh, we got an um, body spray, room spray, bobbing for apples. I like that she's got a cute uh, different style artwork for it. Because normally she's kind of got a basic look. Uh, so yeah, like, I think this is the scent I smelled when I opened the box. It smelled kind of apple-y and really awesome with the other stuff in the box. Uh, here we have, and I think this is, like, exclusive, so you can't just order it, um, by itself. It's just with the subscription box. But it's this little bag, and she's got little, like, ghosts and tombstone confetti in there. You probably can't really see it. And like even a Ouija. You probably can't see it. But. Oh man. It's like. Leveled up cool. Little skeletons on there. Sweet. I don't know if it tells me what it smells like. It might on the little. Handout. Mm, let's see. You will smell the stone from the cemetery headstones, incense, black musk, and rose. So that's cool. Yay! And then this, I wasn't expecting like a cool mug. And I'm kind of glad I wasn't expecting it because it was just packaged with like bubble wrap circling it and nothing inside. So it got shipped. So that's Sucks. but like poison arsenic caution seance in the graveyard like it's a cute mug um i contacted them and they like immediately said they'd ship something else out uh but they seem to i mean it should have been packaged a little better. Normally she packages them, like, everything amazing. So I'm not sure if they were rushed or 
what or if mine just got I don't know and there's a little broken glass in it boo but normally her packaging is amazing I just maybe since it's a new thing subscription box thing um I don't know I maybe mean, someone else packaged it and there's this little bag it's got this cute little like pumpkin-y tape on there and <laughs> I didn't really look at these too well earlier but little stickers oh that one's cute a little haunted house sticker and a little pumpkin I wonder if like these are stickers they made or if they were just random sticker goodies I'm not sure I haven't opened these yet so we'll all be surprised oh I don't know why I feel bad like ripping it you are invited by blank to meet some folks who are never seen by such as we with eyes like ours on any night but Halloween little cards I guess I'm not gonna read them all cuz um, I don't know I get randomly anxious those are cute maybe they're like postcards or the other side's just blank which you probably saw when I was reading the first one but so I wasn't really expecting that either I was just expecting some scents from Sans Perfumes and some soaps from Girl in the Graveyard. This one was just in there. More little um, trick or treat. Maybe these also trick or treat. Trick or treat cards with envelopes, so stationary. Which I wasn't expecting at all, so that's fun. I wonder if I'll use them or just keep them. Let's see. And I'm pretty sure that's it. Uh, the box smells really good. But when I use the body spray, and I like it, but it smells a bit more apple-y on its own than it did with, like, I guess with the soaps. Because I wouldn't think the perfume oil in the container it's in would really... I wouldn't think you could smell it outside of it. But with the soap combination and the body spray, room spray, opening the box smells pretty amazing. So I hope it's a like Halloween subscription box that just I get four times a year. I thought I read something saying you get it four times a year, but maybe it's just a subscription box and this one's Halloween. That makes more sense. So, and Christmas ones would be cool sense. I don't know what they would do in like summer hopefully just randomly Halloween stuff because I like Halloween stuff and fall scents and all that jazz and winter stuff is winter smells are good too so yeah I it was kind of pricey but her stuff normally is and I just like supporting her um, I think I said before they are supposed to send me a replacement so that's pretty cool they responded to me right away saying they'd send a replacement so Hopefully that one's packaged a little better, but we'll wrap inside the mug. We'll be good. Or, I don't know. I know Shutterfly and stuff do like these styrofoam mug containers. So I don't really think they'll do mugs again in the future. Just because I, I don't think they had good luck with this. But yeah. I, overall, I'm pretty happy. I like would love drinking coffee out of this today. It's adorable. So broken. Maybe I'll use it as a cup holder for now. But yeah. So, thanks for watching Sans Perfumes and Girl in the Graveyard. I sure hope that's right. Um, yeah, pretty cool. I'm going to check out Girl in the Graveyard because I haven't really bought her stuff separately before. <laughs>